all bike riders should wear helmets. Really? What if I'm just riding around my campsite? What if I'm just riding to the restroom? What if I'm scouting and riding real slow? Do I really need a helmet on? Well, I put out a survey on the Fat Bike Hunter Facebook group and over 2,000 members answered. 60% of the people said, we wear helmets most of the time. 40% said never. Here's a fact. Over 800 cyclists die every year because of not wearing a helmet. And another 500,000 are sent to the emergency room in the ER. Two thirds of the deaths and one third of the injuries happen to the head and face. A helmet can reduce that risk by 85%. One fat bike hunter member said this, having children, I wear it just to show them that dad wears one and you must lead by example. I've got two boys and I wreck almost daily trying to keep up with them. The speeds they travel on single track are really risky. But what if I'm just going up a service road scouting or what if I'm just slowly hunting on a gravel road? Do I really need a helmet? If you've ever ridden without a helmet, I'm sure you've encountered helmet scolds. People that just want to read you statistics, share stories about their terrible injuries that they sustained without wearing a bike helmet, etc. They'll tell you things like, don't you know that cycling is perilous even for the seasoned rider? One season, I was carefully bringing my two-person ladder tree stand out of the woods using a bike trailer. I had both hands on the brakes, front and rear, and the trailer started to skid and actually fishtail and overcame my bike. I went flying off into the ditch. Thank goodness I had a helmet on because I hit the trees really hard. Another season, I was just flying down a service road just with my headlamp in the morning and all of a sudden there was a cow elk standing broadside in the, in the road. I had to lock up both my front and rear brakes and steer for the ditch. Otherwise I would have ran right into the side of her. Luckily I was wearing a helmet that time. Compared to a life altering injury, wearing a bike helmet doesn't seem to be that big a deal. Seems like something that is worthwhile. If it'll help prevent a brain injury, Many riders feel that it's the good reason to wear a helmet every time they get on a bike. Another Fat Bike Hunter member said this, I had a pre-dawn wreck while traveling downhill on a logging road during a spring gobbler season. The wheel caught a rut and turned 90 degrees on me. It ripped the rubber off the rim and flipped me straight over. I broke my clavicle way out near the end of the shoulder. It broke a rib when the shotgun spun around in the handlebar grips and badly bruised my hip. Helmet saved my noggin. He added a column to the initial helmet use survey that I had posted on the Fat Bike Hunter Facebook group and it said this, his column read, I wear a helmet even when I'm looking at my bike. Helmets only save you the risk of head injuries to a point. We understand skull fractures and those type of injuries. The one injury we don't really understand enough about is concussions. I know personally, even with a helmet on, I've been concussed or knocked myself out a few times. While commuting to work one day, I was flying down a paved road and a gentleman turned in front of me because the sun was in his windshield and in his eyes, he couldn't see me. I impacted the car, went through the windshield, and it woke up in the hospital. They ended up having to take a sixteenth of an inch off the right side of my jaw. 
Now being young and stupid, I was more worried about how my bike was looking and what had happened to my bicycle. It was two days old. It's up to you to consider the risks of wearing a helmet or not. I just would like to see you out on the trail, out on the gravel roads, out scouting, and ultimately out hunting and harvesting. While the choice is up to you, I know I'm going to be wearing a helmet every time I get on my bike.